Hello and welcome back to the desk. Today we are, we are interviewing a frequently requested element. You may know him as AU. His atomic number is 79. He's gold. Hey Gold, good to have you on the show. Good to be here. So Gold, this may sound like a rather insensitive first question, but a lot of my viewers have, here have wanted to know, what's your weight? My atomic mass is 196.967 grams, and I don't care who knows it. Wow, what a guy. So that means you've got about 118 neutrons. Well, that's what you get when you subtract 197 and 79. I don't think we need to mention this, it's really just a formality, but are you, clear you clearly are a solid. Yes, but be careful around me when I'm a liquid, because it takes 1,948 degrees Fahrenheit just to melt me, and 5,085 degrees Fahrenheit for me to boil. Wow, that's hot. So, uh, I've heard a rumor that you were worth $16,136.40 for the Troy Pound. It's true. No! Yes. Well, color me impressed. Speaking of color, doesn't your name origin come from the old English word giolo, meaning yellow? Yes, and my symbol origin from the Latin word aurum, meaning gold. Very interesting. You know these origins are rather old. How old are you? You know, not even I know. I'm so old that I actually forgot who discovered me. That's old. You know, this has been bothering me. You clearly are a metal. But what kind of metal are you? I'm a transitional metal. You know, I've heard a lot of interesting facts about you. Like what? Like that you can occur in a workable state. What can I say? I'm a simple element. It allows me to help in nanotechnology and medicine. Like with the blood test. How do you do that? All that happens is you put one drop of blood onto a test strip, and I drive a color change that can tell you if you have a disease such as malaria. I'm also environmentally friendly. Along with my friends Platinum and Palladium, I act as a catalytic converter in cars. And I'm part of primary treatment for rheumatoid arthritis. What was that? Nothing. No, you grimaced. I, I didn't. Please, be honest. Doesn't your treatment cause diarrhea? Yeah, but only like 5% of the time. Okay, I I'm sorry. No, you know what? I'm not going to take this. I'm out of here. Gold, everybody.